You're at the end of the leash already? Oh, yes, I'm already. We got more leash now. Okay. Very leashy. More room to run. I might, I might want uh, two samples. I think I want some Amphitacella, too. Getting Is greedy. that possible? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what are, we, what are we thinking here? We want the big disky one, and then maybe some of the bally one. Disky and bally. Yep. Two best friends. Disky and bally. And this is going to be a snip and slurp, or snip and slurp. what's it going to be? Well, we can try, but Isn't there's there some talk of clog in the hose. Yeah, there's a clog uh -oh. in the hose. It seemed like there was a sponge that you clipped that sort of stayed in place when you clipped it in the claw. Yeah, it could it could go in a box and and yeah, be it could fine. go in a box. It's got to go in the starboard box. No, no. Uh, we're all open in the front box, I believe. Uh, yep. Now we're talking. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's a horse of a different color. Look at that. So you can see there's like a much smaller Atlanticella to the side, and that's probably an example of um, a snippet of sponge falling off and starting a new colony. I didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> but that's good to know for the last time we uh, <laughs> tried to pick some up and it crumbled. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure it, you actually maybe did it a favor. Robert Spongy Sneed Seed. <laughs> Robert <laughs> Spongy <laughs> Seed. <laughs> Me zoom in, Dave. Adam Rocky Guy. <laughs> Little off the top. Yep, a little bit of a haircut. Oop. Quit it. <laughs> that didn't work. No oh. more off the top. <laughs> <laughs> Jules, do we have an ID for that sponge? This is Atlanticella. Oh, perfect. And the smaller one in front of it is um, Amphidocella. I'm really happy about these IDs because we just have drawers of sponges at MCZ called Periphera. Because they can be really hard to identify. Wow. Yeah. So that's partially why in situ identifications can be helpful. How do you, how do you spell? very interesting. At, um, Atlanta, Sella. What's the, how do you spell the end? A-T-L-A-N-T-I-S-E-L-L-A. I-S-E-L. Oh, ready? Okay. Exactly as it sounds. River yep. Tree. Yep. Okay. Tool tree coming out. Just confirming this one is Atlanticella. Mm -hmm. Which uh, where are we putting this? Uh Lambda. Is that one of them? <laughs> <laughs> it's not Omega, so <laughs> Oh. 
Perfect. Okay, tool tray coming in. I think we got another sample coming, but yeah, yeah. we'll yeah. leave it, we'll leave it want, tucked in. Do you want the whole ball of wax? This one? If you could just take a snip of that one, that'd be great. Really? But if you need to. Okay. Adam, would this be another separate sample or the I same one? I think so, yeah. Okay. It's not, it's not very large. Okay. Yeah. yeah, you know what? Let's Let's take it. There's no shortage of them in this area, which is exactly why we're collecting one. Okay, <laughs> and this is Alanticella. No, yeah. no, the first this one is Amphidicella. Amphidicella. Okay, thank you. I am kind of interested in having the um, spicules that tether it. This is a sample 113. Yep. Cool. Oh, that's so perfect. Yes. That dang stick is in the way. There you go. I wonder if we orb. got the associates. <laughs> okay. Can we go out of the box again? So try coming out. Can it go in the same bin, or does it need to go in a separate bin? It can go in the same one. Okay. Lambda. Tool tray going in. I really missed that uh, down cam view there. Did that thing come off? Yeah. What oh. thing? The Cyclops. The. Hmm. I think he's talking about one of the piloting cams. Oh. It's not cams. a piloting. It's one of the stereo it's cams. The, yeah. yeah. yeah it's oh, it's there. that is what you were talking about. It's here yeah, somewhere. Was, it's here somewhere. I have to find it. Where the it. gauges are. I don't care about those silly gauges. I don't want to look at those. <laughs> you know Nor do I. <laughs> <That one. laughs> No, no, oh. I don't want that either. Black. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I want the oh. I want the, I'm spoiled now. Yeah. What's all this commotion? Where do you want it, Bob? <laughs> I want the. My, my tails are I want it where the gauge is. I want the stereo. Wait, the single, single stereo cam. cam. Single stereo cam. Yeah, okay. <laughs> mono <Oxymoron>. cam. <laughs> Sorry, Mike, that's a Herc problem. I don't know. I'm just letting you know. Yeah. What's a Herc problem? Atlanta getting close to the wall when we're sitting here. Uh, Not wall, but slope. We still got more to climb? Sure do. We yes. are uh, yeah. Low still 100 peak. meters from the peak. <laughs> 100 meters? That's an hour. <laughs> Is it an hour? It's maybe 15 minutes. <laughs> Depends right. on which watch we're talking about. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hours. Depending on the watch. Let's zoom. Let's zoom. Put it in turbo. <laughs> I don't know if we have that mode in this. <laughs> it activates from twelve. It activates from twelve to four. Yeah. You know the, the <laughs> Actually, no. It activates from four to eight. I think. The Jason yeah, ROV 48, has a they turbo zoom. button. Does it really? Yep. How fast can you go? Does it do anything? That's it does do something. <laughs> I'm sorry. Can we see turbo mode? <laughs> No, this Not one, this RV. This one we don't, doesn't we have. Don't, we oh. have a button button, but we don't have a turbo button. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I don't know what the button button is supposed to do, and it's claimed that I asked for the button button. What? <laughs> I know I didn't ask for the button button. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't think in any world you would ask for the turbo button. No, I did ask for the turbo Wait. button. Wait, you Jason, did? That's on the Jason RV. Oh, but not on this one. No, no so he has a button button. I have a button button on <laughs> What's this What's a button What's button. a button button? A button it's that so says that button. Can, look, auto X Y. Button button. <laughs> what? Enable. What? Okay, it actually does say button. Yeah. <laughs> it's a button button. <laughs> what does it do? It makes it so that you can use the buttons. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I'm sorry. What? Wait. If you don't have the button button enabled, then you can't use the buttons. 
They don't yeah. do anything. I. <laughs> there's a button button. What's a button? It's like a lock. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's like a the button button but unlocks no the other button. Other button. Oh, exactly. wait. Um, okay, we we gotta get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> out of the van, actually. Yeah. yeah. Just, I'm I'm actually gonna just. Um. What's, what's really infuriating is I figured out where the button button was in the code and I disabled it. And then when the code guy came back, he re-enabled it. <laughs> <laughs> you disabled the button button. Yeah, I made it so it was always enabled. Oh, Which, it, there's no. no point in... Yeah, why wouldn't you? Yeah. It's interesting. Anyway. Okay, well that was <laughs> a journey. That was fun. Zero six five. Zero six five, right. Can I press the button button? So the and no. the, tur the turbo really like button on it. Jason ROV is used on the surface to give you 12% extra juice. Oh. Oh. So you can maneuver. Yeah. More, beans. more beans. More beans. It's the more beans button. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see that on here. Uh -uh. I still can't believe there's actually a button that says button. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I th thought was going to happen, but <laughs> that one broke me a little bit inside. Okay. Uh, happy for a move. Yes, pilots? Indeed. Bridge, Nav? I'm cool with it too, Samantha. <laughs> <laughs> I am so happy to hear that. Um, <laughs> thanks for sharing your opinion, as always. <laughs> uh, three zero meters, zero six five. Wow, look at that Walteria. That's a tall, tall boy. Tall one. Almost to local peak. Almost. Adam, so our viewers are curious. Uh, so what did he find when he was cutting rocks with his goggles? <laughs> mm. uh, I found some basalts, which is kind of to be expected. But I also found some rocks that I have yet to identify. They're oh. kind of um, clastic rocks, meaning sedimentary rocks. They're cemented together. They're really gorgeous. You could like definitely have them as a countertop. They're like reds and whites and blacks in there oh wow uh, but i've only cut them and have not yet described them but there's a, a big variety in this batch Ooh. so what's the um most rare type of rock you've come across uh in this in this expedition or like f ever ever oh geez i don't know i think uh last Last year at uh, Cayman Spreading Center, we found some uh, cool metamorphic rocks with uh, like big crystals in them. Uh, I, I do like finding basalts with giant plagioclase feldspar phenocris or crystals in them. Those are very cool. Uh, rare rocks. Yeah, those ones. Oh, popping Ooh. rocks. What? Popping rocks popping are the rocks. most rare rocks. Pop pop rocks. Wait, popping? That sounds really cool. What? Like pop rocks? <laughs> like pop they're, yeah, they're, like they're... Oh, stick up at these. Hey. That's pop. fun. Finally. <laughs> they <laughs> are, uh, they contain a lot of gas bubbles and they're, they're very deep. They're like 4,000 to 5,000 meters, and when you Whoa. bring them to the surface, the gas in the bubbles expands, and they go pop, 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 pop. Oh. And you have to put, like, a lid on top of the rocks, <laughs> or the rocks will shoot from, like, one bin to another bin. <laughs> oh, what? what? Wow. Mix up your samples. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is, so is this right here? I'm looking at it. Um, they're found at, can they be found at Mid-Atlantic Ridge? Yeah, that's where oh, we found them. Okay. That's, nice. the, that's the cruise yeah, I'm right looking there. At, oh, wow. This is so cool. Wow. So artistic team, we had another suggestion to <laughs> <laughs> to draw the crack the crack 
<laughs> to be announced. <laughs> Look at this. What's that? <laughs> Some sort of yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Isn't uh, that I don't cool? Think well done, Mike. Zoom in. We have some artists on the boat. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, there's a, a Galathea crab or squat lobster. Ooh, what was that? <laughs> Another Norella and Walteria, and then this thing. That crab looks a little interesting. Maybe it lent a cella. Yeah, let's look at the crab. That's full zoom right there. Oh, okay. That's good. Thank you. All right. Do your crab call to get it to come closer. <laughs> <laughs> crab oh. call. This one doesn't have an anemone. No. It doesn't look like the other ones that have them. Dead right. Atlantis. Like it's a true you crab. Wanna look color. closer, I can get closer to it. Yeah, okay, yeah. I might like to Dead see Atlantis that crab. Okay. And there's a the coral. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We need to get her back out in front. Okay. Yeah, but. But yeah, it's but a crab. <laughs> <laughs> Argus is, no, not Argus. Okay. Ah, Atalanta is going to do what Atalanta wants. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, quick zoom, Dave. <laughs> quick zoom. Atalanta's Otherwise, we pause the ship. <laughs> Don't pause the ship. Hey. Oh, it looks kind of like it's got some growth on it. Right. Does it? Yeah, see on the fuzzy claws? Uh, uh sometimes. Sort of Yeti crab-like. Yeah, yeah. Yeti crab-like. Fuzzy claws. Hmm. Looks like it's feeding, though. Time to go. Okay. We're out of here. Fine. We're out of here. Then. No stops, kids. <laughs> <laughs> we have crab at home. Uh, Should have gone to the bathroom before we left. <laughs> That's why I said. <laughs> Sure. It doesn't look open at the top. It's interesting. Polyopagon. Rosellid. Uh, Caliphagus. Um, not Amphidicella, but the other one. Yeah. Sacacalyx? <laughs> There's a gorilla. Catenary. That's <laughs> 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 catenary. <laughs> All right, new TJ. Oh, there's a. <laughs> there's a. Uh, something. Chris Gorcha, maybe. Oh, that does look like Chris Gorcha. You know, it's this time in the cruise where I get like in, disappointed in myself <laughs> because I'm Why? just sitting here looking at corals. I'm like, forget about the rocks. Yeah, you're doing my job. <laughs> You've lost yourself. I don't yeah. know. I hate to <laughs> do what I call a cinnamon toast crunch retreat. <laughs> where I, I want more of it. I think you should go down oh, there and get some before it's gone. Well, it's okay. Uh, I, I can live with that. I'm telling it. you, it really changed me. <laughs> Geniculata. And nice. a squat That's lobster. First one of those we've seen. Yeah. I love squat lobsters. They're so fun. Look at this. Hey. And the anemone next to it. Right? No? one of those sponges. Yep, Saco Calix. Oh, I hate not knowing how to pronounce it. No, she's talking about, <laughs> what did I say? 
Sponge bone rip parts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Sponge bone rib parts. <laughs> rib parts. Sponge bone rib parts. I don't know how to say it. Rib parts? You're coming up with jingles. <laughs> Sponge bone rib star parts. parts. Oh, is that a sea star? Slice? Oh my gosh. Oh. Is that two sea stars? Or is that one? I think it's there's two. No, I think it's rabbit. Oh, it's one. Oh, okay. That's one. cool, though. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so Connor's weighing in on <laughs> the pronunciation uh, with Sacco Calyx. Sacco Calyx. Sacco Calyx. Sacco -calyx. Wow, that's really. Oh, yeah, it's one. This helps. <laughs> that is so cool. Just What's that down at the bottom? Um, oh. Barnacle? Is that a mollusk? Oh. Yeah, is that it? Full zoom? That's, That's enough. enough. That's yeah. enough. Yeah. <laughs> <Full zoom. laughs> <laughs> All right. Cool. What is that? Spongy thing down there. Uh, which direction is the spongy thing? To the right. Here? Yeah. Oh. Cool. Ferried. Um, it could be a ferried. It could also be a euplectylid. So I'm trying to figure out right now. It could be um dictocalyx. Alright, move it on. Okay, thank you. Dictocalyx? That sounds like Something from asterisk and obelisk. Something what? <laughs> you know those original graphic novels? Oh, asterisk no, that's definitely a Freya. Obelisk. I think that's Freya, in fact. Chat, we are at about 1796 meters. About to get into the good stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're getting to uh, the top of local peak. <laughs> <laughs> Unstocked Amphidocella, another Freya. Oh, can't see this. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, there's something big up to the right. If you want to check it out. Ship move just finished. And uh, it's it looks pretty cool. <laughs> Great. Oh, well, we also want to oh. get her cat ahead again. Where is it at? Uh, You're getting close. <laughs> right there. Oh, wow. Atlanta Silla. Nice. Yeah. Oh, wow. I have a great shot on still cam. That is. You're right. Oh, <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> ah, look at all the sponges. Ferea, Atlanta Silla, Amphidocella, Walteria, Euplectella. That's so beautiful. Polyki, oh, it's a friend. Oh, you're going to lose it. Or grab it. That was a good one. There's another large structure <laughs> behind. Zoom out. So if you keep going. Straight. I guess ahead is probably what I'd ahead. say. Ahead. Oh, very large structure coming up after this one, even. To the right again? Um, just keep going up this way. I think that's a polyopgon right there. And then that's a Sacco Felix. Calyx. Sacco Calyx. Right? Is that what that is? Sacocalyx? Yeah. <sighs> Sorry that Sai is not at you. I'm just, <laughs> there's so it's many sponges. Hey, we got to okay. alter course here. We're okay. getting right. off in the weeds. Thank you yeah. for doing that. Also, no crinoids. Hmm. That's true. Yeah, no carnoids. What's up with that? I don't know. <laughs> we 
we did have a question that came in earlier um, that talked about like shipwrecks, like what would Nautilus do? Um, and the comment uh, mentioned like if we were to find like a historical shipwreck like that of Amelia Earhart, what would we do? Would we turn off the cameras? <laughs> uh, What's the process of probably that? Probably because sometimes uh, you want to protect the location of it. I mean, right. it's not much of protection if you're following the website, you see where we are, we turn off the cameras, and the next day we announce we found something. You could probably figure it out, but still you want to protect it a little bit. Okay, I'm going to put another move. Okay, bridge, nav. Three zero meters, zero six zero. I'm going to dream about sponges tonight. <laughs> Should we collect a sponge? Uh, yeah, I think Atlanticella would probably be a good one because it's kind of dominant in here and we don't have any samples of that. I feel like we should go with Amphidocella. The Atlanticella, the like larger ones? Yeah. But you could convince me otherwise. Okay. Do we have any sampling goals? It's an interesting little channel there. Um, yeah, look at that. looks like that big piece just broke we off. We want to collect samples of the organisms that are characteristic of this area. So if we're seeing a lot of something, we'd want to, to collect it. Right. Um, also, anything new that we find, so we really don't know this area mm -hmm. at all. Um, yeah, some Atlanticella could be good. I don't know. There's so many sponges. I talked with Brian about Atlanticella as a good option, so. Oh, yeah. Okay. But I, you know, I'm agnostic. I'm not gonna, I don't. Like this one? Well, no, I mean, we finished the move. We've, we've seen them pretty much everywhere. We well, do have a history oh, well, of starting Brian moves. Oh, Brian said that Atlantis <laughs> is a good one to sample then, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Oh, Crinoid. there's a crinoid. Ask <laughs> oh, speak of the devil. Holotarium too? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Neptune's tongue, they call that one. <laughs> or I do just now. <laughs> I was gonna say. I think someone's breathing into the mic. Is that me? It's not me. I'm not breathing. It's not me. <laughs> <laughs> me too. I don't breathe. <laughs> <laughs> I have gill slits. We are barely into this watch. Oh, that's not true. We're almost two don't hours into this watch. Two hours. Yeah. Whoa. Time flies. <laughs> Time huh? flies when you're having fun. Yeah. <laughs> barely, there. barely an hour in. <laughs> Um, is it's it possible to sample that what? the sponge right here, Atlanticella? Uh, that's Atlanticella? I don't think that's Atlanticella. You don't think that's Atlanticella? No, it's too smooth. Hold on. Looks like a donut. Mm. I looks guess. Looks like a donut. Someone the wanted donuts. Does look slightly different. People keep saying the word donut, <laughs> and I don't appreciate it. You <laughs> don't. Donut appreciate it. I don't appreciate it. Donut. All right. This is not the the sponge you're looking for. 
Yeah, we can keep moving. Sorry. These are not the droids you were looking for. You got my preference. Yes. Do we know Wish Punch? Is that one? That which, one. Which what? Wish Punch. Wish Sponge? I think. <laughs> yeah, the uh, one that Jules uh, was. Um, the Donut Sponge. Donut um, Sponge. Do we have an ID? Looking into it. Okay. So you do not know? <laughs> <laughs> Do not I do not, not like wish that. to answer. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it looked like uh, Atlantisella, but it might be something else. Oh, nice uh, rock. Yeah. And sponges. Okay, we're uh, about to finish a move. Keep moving. Or you want to look around for a sponge? Um, we can keep moving. If we see Atlantisella, if we could stop to sample, that'd be great. Roger. Okay, are you putting them right at the top of Local Peak? Sure am. Okay. Would you like to go somewhere else? No, no. I want to summit Local Peak. Raj. Try and... Bridge, Nav. Three zero meters, zero six zero. We do have a question for Robert. Hey, um, do you have a favorite kind of sample to take as the Herc pilot? Mm, good question. Uh, <coughs> I'm sort of a shipwreck, shipwreck fan. Oh. So the coolest thing I ever saw was, uh, I sampled, was a compass off a... Whoa, Chanakops. Off a... Uh, Ooh, Chanakops. A ship from 1750 or so. Oh, wow. That's cool. And it still had oil in the compass. Oh, wow. wow. And the compass was still working. Huh. <laughs> it was still working? That's yeah. even cooler. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, and it was super China delicate. Down. We put it in a foam-lined box on the, wow. on the front. That was, that was pretty neat. Zoom in, Dave. It's just chilling there. Highlight. Hello. Chonicops highlights all the time. Got gotcha. you. <laughs> Love it. Oh, that's cool. Chana what? Chana cops. Cops. Deep in contemplative thought. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Staring into the void. <laughs> We've all had that day. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to be a shark when I grew up, and <laughs> here I am. <laughs> Fun fact, all the big Chanakopses are girls. What? Um, the males have um, really extreme sexual dimorphism. They're small and parasitic, and so all the big ones are Interesting. Females. Oh, so all the big wow. Chanakops are female. Mm -hmm. Hey, girl. Thanks for bringing the facts, Megan. Right? <laughs> Still there. <laughs> yeah. Yep. All right. Carry it's not on. moving at all. Cool how uh, she's got her fins kind of wedged yeah. in there. Right? Yeah. Standing up for the ground. Yeah. Do you think um, hunting? Waiting. Waiting for. Just waiting. 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 Like she's waiting. waiting for. Just waiting. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. She just ate. What? what? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we Go that back. <laughs> what? Go back. Rewind Are you serious? That I yeah, her like whole jaw yeah. extended out. Wow. Oh, we missed it. That was Dude, amazing. What? Blink and you miss it. Okay, folks at home, rewind. That was rewind, awesome. rewind, oh highlight, highlight. Just it's moving again. Oh, that is so cool. Resetting. Do it again. Do it again, friend. <laughs> <laughs> We need some bait. Resetting for the lunch. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think, you know, with our, cool. our motion start up a little bit, so I think. Oh, there's a little something oh. swimming by, though. You see yep. that? I think if we just wait. We'll wait for two hours. I'm going to stop the ship here. <laughs> Bridge, no. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. There Eat something, is. please. There this is, is so exciting. That was, like, 
Not even Hold the position. lure out. You can see the lure in between. Right. The okay. okay. Nope. She's not interested in that thing. <laughs> this is oh, so she's fascinating. It. She's tracking it. Maybe we're blowing her cover. <laughs> Shining light. <laughs> <Maybe>. <laughs> Just get a little closer. Nah. <laughs> Dramatic <laughs> thing. It's like the start of our meme contest right here. Oh. 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 There you oh. Go. oh. Oh. She's tensing. Gonna go for it. Gonna go for it. Wait. Oh. Wait, wait. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh, oh there's oh, the lure. Oh, the lure. Oh. Wouldn't you like to see? Uh, oh. 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 She just Other swam way. into the into the <laughs> slurp. <laughs> 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 All right. I'm oh, moving on. I'm moving on. Moving on. Mushroom. Anthemastus. This feels a little anticlimactic after the Chanakop. <laughs> the Chanakop's near attack. <laughs> yeah. Attempted. <laughs> Attempted. <laughs> Attempted. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, oh, she's wait. right there. Another no, no, what? That's no, a it's a shrimp. One. Sorry. Oh, it's a shrimp. <laughs> wait. Wait, no. No, no, what? no, 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 no. go back up. It's a fish. Wait, is it? It's, a, it's, oh. it's one of those uh, yeah, crabs one of those, that we saw, um, or the lobsters. Yeah. So that's yeah. probably what she wants oh, right Connor there. Oh, Connery's telling us it's oh. a blind oh. lobster. <laughs> yep. She wants one of those. <laughs> yeah, we saw one of those yesterday that, with the armored. That's what she was waiting on. <laughs> yep. Is that another sponge? Um, yeah. A fallen one. Yeah. All right. Oh, well, excitement. Onward. There's something cool up to the left, and I'm just saying. Well, the ship has stopped, so. Oh, great. If there's okay. anything here we want to look at. Yeah, no, so this right here. Polyop gone. That's such a fun name. Whoever named that had fun in mind. Chana oh, Cops? Yeah. That's. Polyopagon. Oh, Polyopagon. Taxonomists. We've <laughs> <laughs> got fun in mind. Should see there. No, I must stop talking. <laughs> I'm, I'm hearing Samantha in my head. <laughs> stop talking. You know what? It's not going to get better. It's so only going to get worse. <laughs> so it's working. <laughs> Oh, Connor's given us a little Ceracolophus, not Polyopagon on that one. Oh. Zoom in, Dave. Another. Aha, my Atlanticello is correct. <laughs> Wait, what was that? Oh, what is that thing? What's good? Yep. Our fr our friends online is asking um What's your favorite scientific name? You guys have a favorite scientific name? Mm -hmm. Vampire um, Toothless and Oh, I was going to say that. <laughs> the what? The what? Vampire Toothless and oh. The Vampire Squid. Because it sounds like the like, vampire squid from hell, but it's actually a detritivore, so it eats detritus from the water column. <laughs> I think mine is Dicti Taxitic Texture. That's Whoa. where the crystals what? grow into the vesicles oh. of a volcanic rock. Ooh. Can you say that again? Dictitaxitic. Dictitaxitic. Hmm. Sacocalyx. My second favorite is Sakakalix. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that one. 
I like the Chanakop sounds like a monster truck. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah, that's true. That's very true. Like batrioidal. Batrioidal. That's a good word. Ayala Nima in the background. I believe. That was a really pretty sponge. Yeah, it was gorgeous. I think that was a bolosoma that we passed. Ready for a move? Yep. Mm -hmm. that's, a, that's a hesitant thumbs up, but I'll take it. <laughs> Bridge nav. Let's do uh, three zero meters, zero six zero. Samantha, what has been our speed so far in this watch? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. Maybe it's positive. Maybe we're I going our best. So. I don't. I really don't. Eternal it. optimism. Uh, let me see. <laughs> We've... I actually didn't really know where we started, but uh, we started not long before our uh, sample, right? Mm -hmm. I think I see where we started. Yeah, it's not looking good, y'all. Um, we've got uh, <laughs> 285 meters. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. What? It's oh, pretty bad even for us. Yeah, but it's a wall. It's oh, true. It's a wall. Oh, you're right. Oh, Vertical true. distance. <laughs> Ish. Ish. Yeah. <laughs> Ish. What's this? Is this? Aridagorcha. Aridagorcha. Zumende. That coffee smells good. There's more downstairs. I might need some. Yeah, that's Herodogorcha Bella. And then we have word of the day, a uh, gist. 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 Yes, gist. Yes. I even looked up scientific word of the day, and there's prismatic. Prismatic. Oh. Prismatic. prismatic. Just and prismatic. Some more amphidicella. Zoom in, Dave. Malteria. Hmm. It's interesting that the section of like living Walteria is in the middle. No, I think those are. Oh, the you think those are uh, zoanthids or something on there? Like mm. that for that first thing we saw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The um. <sighs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Brain's going at like thirty percent. The one that starts with the S. Oh, stoliform. No. Stoliniferous. Stoliniferous. Oh, what's that red thing on there, though? Hmm. That's not that jellyfish, is it? Uh. I 
is a, that's an unusual thing though. Chat, the lasers are 10 centimeters apart. They are used for Weird. measurements. Weird, it's like a mutated. It is used for measurements. That kind of looks like a zoophyte in there. Oh, it does. You oh, see the what are those orange things? Uh, Wait, like little glass. orange specks. Go to All right. microscope mode. <laughs> <laughs> I really wish we did have that. We haven't seen that before, right? Uh, we've Those seen little orange specks. The orange, no. All right, I'm good. Some mysteries are better left mysterious. Hmm. Hey, carrying on. Okay, thank you. Controls. Yeah. Do they? <laughs> Not that I know of. <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah, nah. Nah. <laughs> Come on, chat. That's too loud. <laughs> you share a similar trace to me. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Jelly. Jelly. Oh. For everyone who's just too oh, many. Ooh. Is that the Wait, one? is that the same oh, one? No way. No. Wait, what? I think it's just those shorter tentacles. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's not oh. the same. No, it, it totally is. It is? It, it is! Has, oh. Yeah, it just has shorter tentacles. Yeah. Are you for real? Narco and Medusa. And it's gone. Yeah. Fourth sighting. I am over here, like, Fourth pulling sighting. footage to send to our Three expert, of them. Dougal, like, in a rush. <laughs> <laughs> it felt like presence here. I mean, we... We would essentially have to be actively slurping, driving, holding yeah. the slurp. <laughs> <laughs> True. We would have to send Adam down there with a rope hey, <laughs> and a, a net. Okay. Who's a net? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. You need to go have some cereal, young man. <laughs> I, I am going to go get some coffee, but I, I want to see know if you need the any top of local peak. <laughs> uh, you got 100 meters to Loco Peak. Okay. All right. I'm going to go get some coffee and some sugar. I'll be I back. don't think you I'll need be any of those <laughs> items. <laughs> Do we have any sedatives up yeah, there? Yeah, like sleepy tea. <laughs> <laughs> and for everyone who's just tuning in or who's just tuned in, if you have missed our previous dives, check out nautiluslive.org for our highlights. We will be posting more highlights. Um, in the days or in the week to come. One of the great highlights that was just posted is the Narco Medusa uh, that's been spotted now for the fourth time. It was spotted eight years ago on the Okeanos um, vessel. I think that one's Caliphacus. Noted, thank you. Mm -hmm. Zoom in. What are we looking at? 
This is a Rosellid sponge, which I believe is Calophagus. Bridge nav. It's a type of stocked glass sponge. Oh, okay. We've been seeing a lot of them. And three zero meters zero six five, which sort of looks like a wine glass to me. A wine glass? Yeah, <laughs> that one down there. Nice. Zero six five. What's the dominant um, sponge species we've seen, we're seeing so far? Um, we've seen a lot of Amphidocella, a lot of Atlanticella, the, um, oh my gosh, Sacrocalyx. Uh, these two right here are Sacrocalyx. Right. Um, Walteria, Euplectella, uh, Ferrea, those are those are some of the common ones we've been seeing. Oh, okay. Um, the dominant coral species we've been seeing is Primnoid. Primnoid. I actually haven't seen, I don't think, anything else on this dive aside from one Swiftia right. and a few Chrysogorgia. The mushroom coral. Oh, and Anthemastus. Mm -hmm. All right, I There's left one. some out. Ship moves, getting underway. Did I already say that? <laughs> Couldn't remember no. Was my okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This one's Ferrea. Um, no, it's Amphidocella. Still on the lookout for Atlanticella. New coral Range. species. Cuscule. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Just this one up here. Fish. And shrimp. Norella. Okay. No man, Dave. Seeing that this, or this dive. Getting up there. Yeah, still have a slope, but this is, it levels out when we get up to the top of uh, mm. local peak. <laughs> I just want to know who named <laughs> I you know. know, me too. <laughs> local peak. <laughs> local to who? <laughs> Sponge community here. <laughs> I have a really cool Amphidocella coming up and a wall. Uh, Push it up. Okay. Okay. I can do that. Oh. Gross. So pretty. Wait, if I just try it. We get a nice eve. <laughs> I 
another polyopagon to the left. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. much to see. Uh, another move? Okay, great. <laughs> yes, <laughs> please. <laughs> Sorry, we were off mic back here for a second. Uh, hello? Hello. Hello? <laughs> hello? <laughs> uh, three zero meters, who is zero six five. <laughs> is this the person to whom I'm, I'm, I am speaking? <laughs> <laughs> Adam, why are you wearing uh, safety glasses on your head? Uh, I was cutting rocks earlier, and yeah, I forgot okay. to put them back in the drawer, so I thought I'd just keep them there so I remember. Well, it so. adds some authenticity to the endeavor here. <laughs> <laughs> then we do have a question. Has any scientist on board ever discovered and named a new species? Oh. Why? On board Nautilus? I, I guess it wouldn't happen like it could happen over a longer period of time right. so we might see something on board might get a sample might go to some taxonomists and do some genetics and then later on get named so yeah describing a species takes a lot of time and often genetic analysis um it used to be that corals were identified based on morphology but then they found that that actually wasn't a very accurate way of identifying things um, because a lot of corals look really similar but are actually genetically different right so, so we're talking yeah, it can take a long time right so we're talking years correct mm -hmm. uh, possibly I mean it also has to do with how much of a priority it is to right. study oh, so okay. that's a cool one do we know what that, that is that is really cool um, I'm not sure what that is Yeah, I mean, some... Okay, I'll continue after this. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> you're fine, you're fine. It looks a little bit like Corbitellinae, but I don't... Mm. Eh. Mm. I don't think it's that. Oh, actually? <laughs> I could really do this all in my head. Um, no, no, we enjoy the the process I just instead I make a lot of like door hinge noises yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's Corbitellinae Corbitellinae is that maybe you know Atlanticella in the background there it looks like it could be yeah Jules can I see the idea real quick yeah do you need the name yes um <laughs> Thanks. Yes. Yeah, can we sample that sponge back there, the large one? Bridge, Nav. We got a ways to go still, but yeah. Hold position. A ways to go, but. How does it the end of the leash? So. Okay. Is this from our viewers on IG? Yep. Draw the Kraken? The Kraken? Yeah, like so the big whoa. octopus, I think. Well, Adam, it'll be a self-portrait for you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> for our conversation. Yeah, wow, it wow. want to be the Kraken. Oh, no, but I settled on, well, that's a hairy Walteria. Yeah. Zoom in, I settled on that owl from <laughs> Clash of the Titans. <laughs> so Here's your chance to redeem owl. yourself. <laughs> 
Adam's jokes keep cracking us up. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> Dave, I got him. Just on point. Yeah. Did you have cinnamon toast crunch? <laughs> I didn't have any when I went down there. No. Mm. It seemed like. I've been uh, beat up by a series of uh, equipment failures and workarounds and fixes. And Look I at all the amphipods running around here. I guess I'm just a bit giddy. Oh Look at all those guys. They're everywhere. Oh wow. <laughs> Yeah, why are there so many amphipods here? Um, oh. I don't know. I mean, sponge sponges provide great habitat for yeah. little critters. This is way wow. more than we saw before. Right. This is a place to be. Protection, a lot food. Of why is oh, this wow. Walteria so hairy? Long spicules. I don't know. It's it could impressive. help them to healthy, right? catch food. Mm. Yeah. More surface area, more particles. We're demanding a lot of answers from you right now, aren't we? <laughs> We're what? <laughs> We're demanding a lot of answers from you. Like, why are there <laughs> amphipods? Three why zero meter scary? zero six five. <laughs> so who grows slower, sponges or corals? Who what? Who grows slower? Oh. No. Um. I don't actually know the answer to that. Corals. But I want to say, yeah, thank you. But I'm just guessing. I want to say <laughs> corals. Like yeah, I, guess that too. I would like to say corals. They are some of the um, oldest marine right. organisms found on Earth with some living uh, past 4,000 years. That's the oldest coral that they've dated, a uh, black coral off the coast of California. Um, it might be hard to date a sponge with corals. You can, um, corals have like growth rings um, and you can take cores or cross sections to determine age. And you can also um, do stable isotope analysis or radio isotope analysis. Wow, look at this. Um, and they also provide us with climate records. That's really interesting. With Oops. sponges. I don't know how you date a sponge. <laughs> Very carefully. <laughs> Look at that. Can we zoom in? Zoom in, Dave. Please. Thank you. This is really beautiful. Is that a black coral? I think it's a primnoid. Primnoid. And it might be Calyptrophora. Mm, actually, no, it's not that. That's really beautiful. Yeah, those look like primnoid polyps. Cool. Whoa. Thank and you. And then Jules, um, the yeah, what's up? viewers are asking, how do corals provide you with climate information? Um, so, as I was saying, corals have growth rings, um, so we can look at these rings and tell how much they grew every year. Um, and the growth of these corals is directly related to environmental variables like temperature, um, pH, um, etc. And even the composition of their skeletons yeah. can right, tell you right. some of that information. Yeah. So that. A lot of corals will uh, kind of suck up different elements at different rates depending on water temperature and the like. Yeah, you can you can look at trace elements that the corals have taken up. You can also 
yeah. <laughs> Thank you. There's thanks, a lot thanks corals can tell us. Right, right. I think that's hyalinema on the ground. And mm -hmm. that's um, a raw salad up there. Um, Carophagus. Calophagus. Jeez. <laughs> Calophagus is what I meant. Uh, Polyopagon, Freya, Walteria. I love Freya, it's, they're so pretty. Yeah. We've got some cool stuff coming up. Looks like we have an overhang. Oh, right. If you're looking at Atlanta, Cam, see something very large. Maybe a boulder. We're not getting much else in uh, sonar. Do we have any Walteria samples from at all? <laughs> in this dive? Uh, yeah. Oh. Whoa, Whoa, that's a sponge. Wow. Nice. That's a sponge. Whoa. Lots of associates. Oh, what? That's really neat. Um, no, uh, Jules, you, we don't have a Walteria sponge sample in this dive yet. Um, I would love a Walteria sample. Bridge, Nav. Hold position. I would also like, so when we were down at the base of this thing, there's a bunch of rocks that look like they kind of came off of this. I'd like to get one of those, too at the base of this boulder. Uh, what are we doing first? Oh, well, whatever you like. I don't, uh, oh wait, how about we, if we're gonna do front basket, why don't we put a rock in Omega and then Walteria on top of it? All right. Something you like? Um, I'm trying to see. I don't, I don't want something too big, but like that. Or if that's too big, then I don't know. How's that one look? You got lasers on it. It's 20 centimeters across. What you reckon? Uh, let's go for this one, a little bit smaller. Sorry, which one? Uh, just what the lasers are on right now. Okay. reach around this wine glass here. <laughs> oh, <right. laughs> I think we actually have that already drawn. Bolosoma or wine glass. We have that on the art wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. That was mine. Oh, great shot at Atlanta Cam of uh, a sponge on the boulder.
have off comes. Uh, was this the one we were looking at? No. Uh, it was back a little but bit, but I take the one in that's closer to you as well, if you want. This? This. That one? That's, that's that like 60 centimeter <laughs> long. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that going to come? I don't know. I'm going to see. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's a big oh, rock. That's too big. That's too <laughs> big. Um, bum, 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 bum. Let's see. Can you slide your uh, manip a little bit? Yeah. Are we zoomed out? No. I mean, maybe uh, we could we could try harder to get something. That one came up easier than I thought. Well, let's see if that one is. That's still pretty big, isn't it? Yeah, it's half the size of the other one, though. Paula, are you in the chat? Mm -hmm. Right now, yes. I started a direct message with you. You did? That yes. <laughs> I'm I'm I am the data logger. Oh, account. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, we I'll just start a new one. To <laughs> Thank you. Hop a little bit. Okay. Oh wait, what about that one there? That looks smaller. There we go. Yeah, I like it. Is it candy corn? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that looks like your kind of rock. Yeah, it is. A, that's a beaut. <laughs> Thank you for the spin. Have the pictures. <laughs> Tool tray? Yeah. Okay. Tool tray coming out. Watch out for floaty bits. Uh, that's fine. Walterior topper on that. And that was 114? Yep. Is, is this one right here okay? Very the Walteria? Yeah. Yeah, that's great. Any old Walteria will do. Still tray closed. I think it's too far to reach. But oh, <laughs> Look at all those strands. Holy moly. So cool. I don't know how people determine different species of Walteria. They all look so similar. Is one hairier? Yeah, there are some that are hairier. Okay. There are some that are hairier than this, even. How much of this are we going to grab? Um, just a little snip off the top. top zoom in just a little in. haircut. Like a quarter? Just below the brittle star. Yep.
Nice. That's perfect. I'm knowing you're ready for the tool tray. Oh, look at this. Yeah. Okay. Tool tray coming out. Tool tray's out. Samantha, can you zoom out on the high pack and see what's ahead for us? I sure can. Oh, sorry. Two, three, you were in the middle quick. of something. Uh, I was in the middle of trying to figure out if the view in Atlanta Cam was a giant coral or a giant sponge up above on oh. the boulder. <laughs> giant sponge, and I think it's the one that we already saw. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, Adam, you want to zoom out? Yeah. Tool tray closed. You. So here's uh, waypoint two. How far do you want to go out? Uh, I kind of like the follow this ridge kind of path. Like, I don't think we need to go. Follow this ridge here? Yeah, exactly. I don't think we need to cross over to that other area. To the other waypoint? Yeah. OK. Well, with the time we have left, uh, that won't be happening anyway, so. No, I know, but for the next folks yeah. that come in. Roger. Will they be deciding recovery time, or? We're covering at four. Oh, okay, that's been decided. Yeah. Roger. Cool. Okay. What else here, science? I think we got this place pretty well covered. Okay. I'm happy with my sponges. Thanks, everyone. We do have our viewers um, wondering about our internship. I know Nautilus accepts interns. Um, they're also wondering, do we accept internship applications from people who aren't students? Well, um, yeah. yeah. I am currently this one of these expeditions internship. They have actually different programs. They have a communications fellowship, right. a science intern, which is where I applied through. They have an engineering internship also and a video engineering to um, the other interns are on other watches. So I think they will be more than happy to explain further what their responsibilities are. But yes, as far as science internship goes, it's been pretty great. and. If you look in the Instagram takeovers, we put the link there for the internship, and they are also not else live. The application is very straightforward, and the experience so far has been great. You get to learn alongside scientists that are leading in their respective fields. And one thing about the Nautilus is that it's very multidisciplinary, so you not only get to learn about fellow marine biologists, but also geologists, engineers, and other ramifications because we really don't know what to expect on the deep sea you never know what you're going to find and and being a student i don't think is a requirement right yeah it's nope. uh recent students um as well as community college undergraduate and graduate students for the internship tracks and then for the science communication fellowship it's informal educators formal educators and science communicators which can extend to writers and artists as well um, and then so we much. also uh will uh, in a few months, open up uh, applications for contractor positions for junior oh, and wow. senior p contractors um, coming out for the season. So um, if you're already kind of in the field, but uh, maybe early career or maybe later in your career, there's also opportunities to, to join the Nautilus team. Thank you. Stay tuned on yeah. all of those coming out something later this year. Something for everybody. Yeah. There is, there is something <laughs> for everybody. Yeah. Check out nautiluslive.org um, chat uh, for more information. That's a cool sponge. Yeah, that was a cool sponge. Right. Okay, Herc's out in front, ready for a move. Question mark. 
great <laughs> bridge to have. <laughs> As three zero meter is zero seven five. Zero seven five. We gotta we gotta land on the peak. Or the arbitrary target that was set on this peak. <laughs> <laughs> And this is a question for our ROV pilots. I would chalk bed liner make a better paint for the porch. I do not. Like, I, mean, <laughs> I don't. I don't know what that. Oh, there was much discussion about the the finish on the porch. Yeah, the, the problem with chalk bed liner, we discussed that, <laughs> is that <laughs> if you get it, it, it's tough stuff. But if you get a nick in it, then the water gets underneath it, and the Aluminum will just bubble up right there, and then it, it'll all just peel off. Mm. Yeah. So what is this finish? Paint? It's it's has like a zinc chromate kind of. Uh, I don't know what you call it. It's we should it's a chem, chem film kind of thing on the aluminum. We should um, anodize it. Um. Yeah. That's. We didn't do that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that sort of has the same problem, you know? Yeah, flakes off. It's like wherever there's a little ding, it starts to bubble up there, and then and then it's a big mess. Well, it's not the the best solution, but if we chromed it, that would be the coolest looking front porch. Uh, that would be horrible. <laughs> that would be exactly... <laughs> Not what we want. But for, <laughs> but, but for one dive, we'd be so fast. We don't even need, need a turbo button. What? You know, they, they uh, made chroming illegal in, in I, I don't know if it's California-wide, but oh, what? maybe what? L.A. Why is that? But yeah, because you it's can't, so toxic? Yeah, because it's so nasty. They oh. and, then that's, and it's such a car culture there. It's like. There's a lot of people up in arms. Oh, you know? yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, you can't get things chromed anymore there. Hmm. Wow, that's interesting. It's probably for the best. Right. This one looks unusual. Have we seen that? Yeah. Um, it looks like uh, Can we zoom Califacus on? to me. Yeah. That's... Yep. I thought you wanted to get to the top of the peak. We're th pretty much there. <laughs> <laughs> We're there. We made it. Okay, I, I've stowed We're a flag it. to plant. No, I didn't even. Can we zoom in, Dave? Kind of near the target. <laughs> but it's not even the, like the geographical like peak, so don't really know where that is. It's not a real waypoint. It's also not a real waypoint, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> um, I think this is Bolosoma. Cool. Noted. Thanks, Paula. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Not a real waypoint. My dreams are all false. Close enough. Yeah. You'll get your other chance to have an achievement over a small. Oh yeah, you're small. You're in the small hall the of small fame. <laughs> the small of fame. Small. So small. small. Ship moves association. It's not on America. here where I can see it. <laughs> I feel like we're on it, aren't we? We're we're close. We're very close. We are if Robert goes a little more to the right. <laughs> there you go. We're ten meters away from it. <laughs> no. So we're technically. Well we need to see it. all this anyway. This is Yeah, that's super it important. It's like a wow. junkyard. It's like though. a sponge <laughs> garden. Yeah, it's like a sponge garden. That's true. Sponge Beauty garden. in the eye of the beholder. <laughs> <laughs> junkyard to some. Yeah. Beautiful garden to another. It's all about I perspective. I think it's lovely. Look at that. Polyopagon. There's a lot of Walteria. But where's the corals? Oh, there's a big No, yeah, that's what I was wondering. There. Yeah, so this top. is really sponge dominated here. Yeah. I would expect to see more corals. That's cool. I don't even know. I think that's awesome. I'm happy about this just because uh, sponges are cool. 
no real reason other than I like looking at them. Jules, what would, what would you say is the dominating sponge here? Here? Yep. Walteria, oh, maybe. Maybe Walteria. Probably Walteria. Did we get it? Uh, yeah. Sorry, I think we're about to get blown off here. Uh, we are almost on local peak. If you go... Uh, <laughs> Horace. But bless for trying. <laughs> Zero seven five. Yeah, we're getting blown off. Um, but the ship's kind of holding position. Is there's it, there's the, some current up here. Though. Yeah. There's this is the best place to get blown off. It's downhill in every direction. That's true. I'd say we found the peak. Though. Yeah, we did. Yeah, I think we did. Yeah, nice. We did. And we have. Oh, if you go straight ahead, Robert, five <laughs> meters. Five meters. <laughs> <laughs> five meters. Are we there? We're getting there. It's, Are if there you have yet? five meters, tether. This is, this is it. Right <laughs> why? Why does this watch not make good time? <laughs> For musk. <laughs> oh, almost, we're almost there. I'm going to document this moment. And the ship's getting blown off in the perfect direction. Oh, nope. <laughs> Missed it. It's oh. okay. One day. <laughs> One day. Our, uh, Atlanta actually went over it, so. Oh, nice. Score. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> yep. Yeah, nice. Like, I just rolled in here and hit the local peak. <laughs> You know, there's an emoji with a red flag. We can put it on the telestrator for the next <laughs> waypoint. <laughs> <laughs> <No. laughs> Dave was in such a good headspace till you mentioned <laughs> the emojis on the telestrator. Oh, no. Dave is in <laughs> you don't get any position. emojis? Like, we don't why get even any. have them there if you don't get to use them? That's a very good That's point. a great question. <laughs> I'm, ju I'm just asking questions. <laughs> and we yeah. have all the, it's like, the, the football, what is it? Yes, it's the same telestrator that they use for Monday Night Football and I all just, kinds of other things. Ah, uh, it's so Do you get emojis yeah, on Monday Night there's Football? Something. There's all kinds of football icons and golf icons. And Do all they use them? I don't know. We're not supposed to. I've used them in the past. They really are more yes. distracting than anything else. And in the past, a bunch of stuff got messed up because people were putting more emojis. But that in. was that was when they got <laughs> carried away. Like, yeah. I mean, you're just putting a hard stop on any emojis. That's no good. That's censorship. <laughs> oh man. Just saying it's a tool for science. Science tool. Um, so, Sam, you want to get them? Going yeah. in, or are they already going? Uh, we're we're standing by to get. What is going steady on again? with their our USBL right now? Or uh, is that USBL on high pack or? <laughs> yes. Holy man! Uh, it's well, it's it's tracking. Uh, Atalanta can sometimes bounce around. Atalanta is the green line. Um, oh. Herc is the red, and when we're on. <sighs> Sometimes it happens, they're just kind of spare pings. Although I think I'll reset her while we're sitting here. Well, okay. We had to have gone over the waypoint. Are you setting DVL? Times. Yeah, we did. Okay. Oh yeah, we're on it. Now we're fully on Local peak. Oh, I knew I felt. A well, no. Disturbance. Just a little. <laughs> Is Only the right, which way are we headed? This spot. Uh, are we we're doing? waiting for the ship to stabilize. But but I think, know, I think we're there. We uh, we're going to go. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, look. <laughs> Why? Thanks, Dave. Wow. Dave. Wow. Thank you. 
Dave let us have an emoji. <laughs> that's more of an animation. That's, there. that's yeah. like way that's more cool. than just a Stay emoji. there, she. Wow. It's more than an emoji. <laughs> State of mind. Yeah. Oh, and it's gone. <laughs> that was it. That was it. One Hope you guys only. enjoyed it. It'll sure never did. happen I did. again. <laughs> I thought that was pretty cool. <laughs> it was pretty neat. <laughs> Yeah, our viewers are tuning in. Like, um, can we look at this, please? Mm. Okay, <laughs> after, 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 after chat, after. No, tell us what are they no, saying? No, they're okay, just okay. wondering why we aren't um, utilizing the, Time. why they aren't seeing the. <laughs> oh, the telestrator. Yeah. Oh. Because yeah. it'll be really What'd cool. They say. Yeah, it would be cool, but it's like more for us to be like, hey, can you look over here? Can you look yeah. over there? Right, right. Not everyone wants to see that. You said we're not using it. Probably be what? distracting. Why don't we <laughs> send that over <laughs> the stream? <laughs> what is this? Hmm, that looks like a dead sponge to me. Is it a demo sponge? Is it? Hold on. I believe it's some sort of demo sponge. Don't see too many of those. Thank you. They're white when they're alive, right? Um, or is there colored sponges? Mm, not necessarily it could have some pigment that's not what you usually see i really don't know what this is i feel like it's a demo sponge that's neat um yeah if anyone has seen this before or has any ideas let us know I'm stumped. Dave, do you have eyes on a deck cam by any chance? Uh, I can. What you got? Can you tell me if it's raining outside? Like, if there's a squall <laughs> moving through? We just had a really big I was increase just in wind. Oh, uh, was no, it? No rain. No rain? No, I didn't see any rain. Okay. Maybe we were discussing a little bit. Okay. The other day we had a big squall go through and it spiked everything and it also blows off DP, so... Um, oh. Wondering if that was the issue, but it's dropping down already, so. Okay. Has there been changes to the to the way things are over there? I can see better. Yeah, it's the colors. Yeah. Cheyenne has been experimenting with different colors. Who has? Cheyenne. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Ship's holding position so we can keep going. Roger. Cool. Six five still? Uh, I think we're going to change a little bit to get on this ridge, Adam. Are we thinking, whoops, are we thinking uh, like right down the ridge? Yep. Are we thinking? Yep. Okay, just yep. Not, it's not so much for going down it, but like attacking the slope up. I think that's the best spot for it. Okay, so not, not angled to either side, but no. right on the ridge. Cool. Okay, so that'll be uh, zero four zero. Bridge nav. Uh, three zero meters, zero four zero, and you're ready. Robert, it looks like you're gonna come down, I don't know, 30 meters or something. Okay. Correct, yep. Oh, shout out to our friends from the LAPD. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, wow. That's cool. Hey, Do you want us to detain in. Robert? Until you <laughs> <get him? laughs> For driving too slow? Do I, uh, <laughs> do I get to get the bounty? Too <laughs> driving too slow. A little lane of walker speed here. <laughs> I mean, we did leave out of Hawaii, so. Sorry? We did li leave out of Hawaii, so it's not uncommon. It's <laughs> Iowa style. 
Okay, we are starting that move. Let's see how this ridge turns out. And a little stretched out here. Yeah. Got to wait. Why don't we zoom in, Dave? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Want to zoom in? Atlanticella or Polyopicon? Mm. <coughs> Looks like, I think polyoptagon. Yeah. Polyoptagon. Like these threads, so are these at a certain species of sponges or do all of them? Some have them, some okay. don't. Um, it does depend on the sponge. So like polyopagon have them, so do um, hyalinema. But like most stocked sponges or I guess all stocked sponges they don't have them um, yeah yeah uh, cool does that help them like how does that help them adapt um it tethers them to the rock or sediment they're right. attached to Ooh. so okay it, it keeps them in place so I better Thank wait you. a while. <laughs> so we're going to have to uh, re rethink here if we're going down slope. Okay. Well, we're on, yeah, it's hard to tell. You want to flip around? Flip around. I just, I got to not be out in front. No. Well, you say it's just 30 meters and then we're on a ridge again? Or? Well, we're, uh, it's hard to tell from this map, but uh, t yeah. All right. Might be a ridge here, it might be a down and then up. Let me see if I can. Yeah, it should go up after that. Yeah. All right, well, I'll just stay in close here. Okay. I mean, we could just fly across and not stay in contact with the bottom if you want. Uh, well, I, I think this will be okay. Okay. We just side swipe, side swipe down here and uh, I'll just stay in close so he's not dragging along the hilltop. Oh yeah, okay. These uh, cross-sections on the dive track are helpful when I look at them. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. It's a little... Skip down and up. up. All right. Question for our ROV pilots: Is there a dif uh, is there a difference or preferred delta between Atalanta and Herc than between Argus and Herc? If so, why? Uh, no, the the delta depends on how long the tether is that we have. Mm. Uh, so we had swapped out from a thirty meter one, and we were maintaining a what were we at? We were like fifteen delta. 15 meter delta. Now we're we have a 37 meter long tether, and we're doing more like 17, 18 or so. But it depends on uh, how far away Herc is from Atalanta. Right. So when you're stretched out, you can get down closer to the bottom. And then other times, like here, we're we're on the edge of a slope, and we want to maintain more of a delta in order to not be dragging Atalanta along the top of the ridge here. Is 
Thank you. And chat, if you are curious about Ar Argus is fine. <laughs> and Little Herc is fine. Argus is just fine. They're, they're fine. That's what you I can would even, say. You can they see. Were fine. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah. That's questionable. Argus. It is visible on the deck. <laughs> yeah. You can see Argus on the deck. They, they are fine. Okay. Can we zoom in, Dave? The shrimp, yeah. <laughs> it's the shrimp. It's Horus. What's uh, what's growing on the rock right there? Oh, can it be barnacles? Encrusting sponge. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, it doesn't look like barnacles. Oh, oh. kind of. So on. What it's does it look like? That's got to be sponge, right? This one looks a little spongy. I don't know, because it's got all those little holes right along the... Mm. Oof. Like sponges. It's <laughs> 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 almost <laughs> like... They're way too big. Large pores. Yeah, those yeah. are really large and irregular pores. I don't, I don't know about that. Okay, cool. So. Who knows? Maybe someone will watch this later be like, aha. Aha, the thing I've been <laughs> looking for. My whole <laughs> life, I finally found it. Yeah, it's right next to Local Peak. <laughs> <laughs> How many times have we gone to picnic up on Local Peak? <laughs> they all knew. said, you won't find anything cool at Local Peak. Don't go to Local Peak. It does sound like a bit of local a horror, peak is lame. horror movie. Yeah, it does. Well, they were all wrong. OK, keep moving? Yep. Yep. Bridge nav. Zoom in, Dave. No matter how many times I have read Three the zero name, meter, zero I four still zero. don't know how to pronounce it. Nice. Zacho Calyx. Faraday and uh, Arctonic Calyx. Norella. Norella. Xenophia 4. Who eats Bacteria. dead sponge? Lots of things. Um. Oh, it's a good question. I don't really know. Or actually. is there? Or is all the skeleton make it tough to? Ooh, what's that? Zoom in, dude. Is it a bad fish? Bad fish. Is it? <gasps> no, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Is that? Yeah. Oh. Or is it? It's like the gray chonicops. Oh yeah, you're right. Oh, <laughs> is it hunting? Predate on something. So little. Oh, Connor says it's a juvenile chonicops. Oh, they are this color before they turn red. Oh. <laughs> Stop it, you guys! Jesus, that is like the least cute. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's so adorable, though. How is Anything that this Chana Cups does is cute. Look, it just moved. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting because the adult we saw earlier did have kind of like a gray tint. Right, right. It's underneath. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah, underneath. Like an interior. Right. Yeah. Wow. A juvenile Chana Cups. Cool. So they just grow an extra skin on the outside when they become adults? I guess. <laughs> That's not how that works. That's, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> not everything we say on Nautilus Live. Uh, <laughs> can we take this back? <laughs> take oh, yeah. everything with a grain of salt. Trust but verify. <laughs> don't, don't trust. Just verify. <laughs> okay. Sponges, anyone? Ooh, is that a uh, metal gorge over there? Yeah, it looks like it. You uh, zoom in, Dave? Or Magnus Morales? Oh. Um. Oh, yeah, it's a little Magnus Morales, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, you see the. Magnus Morales, maybe Bella. No, wait. No, not Magnus Morales. Urtigorgia, Bella. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I didn't know about that one. It's either Bella or Magnus Morales. Uh, I'm going to go with Magnus Brallis. I don't think that's Bella. No. 
bellows, like 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 longer and more regular and more concentrated at the front. Okay. Yeah, Magnus Morales. Shot. It does look a little bit like a wasteland over here. Yeah, it does. Things are looking a little more dead than alive. Any thoughts on why? Mm. Nutrient? Current? A lot of threads too, but not a lot of um. a, lo a lot of broken bent over sponge. It's hard to say. So apparently sea urchins pray they like they eat sponges. Really? Yeah. I even saw, um, I'm even eating some crustaceans and zooplankton too. Oh, really? I mean, there are a lot of things that have died here, but it's it still looks like a pretty healthy ecosystem to me. There's still a lot of diversity and a fair amount of of organisms. Another Magnus spiralis. I don't know, that one doesn't look too spiralis y to me. Hmm. Should we leave it at Iridigorgia? Actually, it might not be Iridigorgia at all. Oh. That's interesting. Chrysogorgia, <laughs> perhaps? Tight. Oh, it's a squat lobster. Yay. Annie, you got a name for all our, all the squat lobsters we see? Um, so all the shrimp. Okay, let's just um settle this now. Let's review. All the, all the <laughs> shrimp. All the shrimp is Horace. That's Mr. Horace. All the boobies is Carlos. You know, Carlos, yeah. Carlos. <laughs> Carlos. And then we have our two friends, Frank and Shelly. Shelly? Oh, yeah, The Shelly. white tips. She's nice. And the squat lobster. Oh, wow. I think that's just Chrysogorgia. Okay, let's name him a Samoan name, yeah? Okay. Ooh. Squat lobster. Let's go with um Yosua. 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 Yeah, Yosua means Joshua. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Yosua. do we have, what if what if we tried to do our names in Samoan? Oh, yeah, that's what I was thinking, yeah, you know. So cool. Adam is Akamu. Akamu, and, that's yeah, so Akamu. cool. So his Jules is Kiuli. Uh, I love that. Uh, okay, uh, uh, David is Tavita. Nice. Tavita. And then stand by. <laughs> <laughs> wow, cool I'm shot. I'm sorry, stand by. I'm spacing out. Check it. Awesome. Oh, so cool. Well, what's the name of the squad lobster, uh, Annie? Yosua. Yosua. Yeah. Look at Yosua. <laughs> I, will, I will stand by. I, will, I promise I will get back. Annie, you <laughs> had the other me. ones like ready to go. <laughs> yeah, you. <laughs> was very I impressive. didn't know you'd have one for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'd consider changing my name to a Kamu. That's what about my cool. full name? Like, what? like is that for Jules or is that for Juliana? Oh, for Jules. For Jules. Oh, that's a good question. Because usually when we when we say um, uh, Mike, it's Mikey, but it's like similar. Mikey. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, you know, like seriously, you know, like Mikey. yeah, say Mikey. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> the first two really inspire respect. Mikey it is. Um. <laughs> you will be Mikey from here on out. <laughs> Not the first time. Probably won't be the last. <laughs> Well, now you have a real place here. You're no longer a new TJ. <laughs> 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 You've graduated to Mikey. <laughs> to Mikey. There's a crying oh, noise. Everybody was enjoying Three my frog faces on the back deck. Ooh, that's cool. We were. Mikey. I need to give up. There's a little sponge down there that looks like a donut. Don't not start with that. Oh, God. That's the first thing I'm going to eat when I get back on land is a donut. Mm -hmm. I don't even think about yeah. donuts that much. I don't even eat them regularly. But like For every some time reason, someone mentions them, I'm right. like, I need that. That's a spiny squat lobster there. Sure is. Yosua. 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 That's bro Yosua right there. <laughs> what about the sponges? Oh. Oh, you're asking for the Psalm 1 translation? Um, sponges. Well, okay. It's so weird because my language is funny. <laughs> So it's in Samoan, it's, um, it's, it's called Sipangi. Sipangi? Yeah, Sipangi. Sipangi. But what's this one's name? <coughs> Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's personal Yeah, name. but what about this one? <laughs> I mean, I mean, we have well, to Well, Annie, do you, have a, do you have a Samoan name? And yeah. So, um, so Annalise, uh, my family call me Annalise. Mm -hmm. Annalise? Yeah. Annalise. Yeah. She's called Annie. Any Usually, my, my family say that when they're mad at me. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So they say we'll my full name. That. Yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> say my full name in someone when they're mad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's an international yeah. parental uh, <laughs> skill. Whoa, look at this. What's all that? That's a dead one. Don't zoom on that. <laughs> Do you want to see that? I thought it looked cool. She, she put a circle oh, on it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Wait, no, I look. I illustrated it. <laughs> Let me have my pokes. <laughs> Zoom in, Dave. It's time to turn this bus around. <laughs> Science can't make decisions. <laughs> Do we need to separate you two? <laughs> there, are you happy? Are you happy? <laughs> I, I sit here patiently while you look at your rocks. <laughs> Okay, we said we wouldn't do this on air. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm satisfied. Don't, Don't make me dead. come back there. <laughs> <laughs> so, that sponge? Yeah. Okay. How many meters do we get? <laughs> <laughs> Not <enough>. like one. <laughs> okay, are we ready? Well, no, let's get her in front and then we'll do another move. If you would like. Yeah. Crinoid? Go for it. Crinoid. Go on for it. Bridge nav. Uh, Paolo, we saw a Chrysogorgia a while zero back. Meters, zero I have the species. Oh, great. I, I can update its species. OK, cool. Tricolis. It's T-R-I-C-A-U-L-I-S. Are you doing her in front or behind? I think I'm bumping along the bottom here. So <laughs> <laughs> that was not an answer to the question. <laughs> I think at this time I don't need to be out in front. I need to okay. be where I am. Great. <laughs> <laughs> I am happy you are where you are. I can just cruise along with. A Zen moment. Okay. You can keep them coming, though. Okay, right here. As long as we can keep up. Sure we can. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are there any particular uh, 
It's like we're on the flats now. Yeah. No Just particular humps. biology goals right now. That's, yeah, well, I was going to say we've got half an hour, so Adam, any rocks? <laughs> Are you good? Uh, we've got 38 minutes. Yeah, and so we have I'm 37 minutes until you yeah, take yeah, a rock. 29 <laughs> until I really see a good rock. Okay. No push cores? No, I don't. That would be the spot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this slope actually goes. looks great. <laughs> yeah, they haven't taken any push pushers in this dive yet. Okay. Niskins? No Niskins either. Man, oh, man oh, we kind of miss okay. we kind of miss some oh, Niskin opportunities back there. Yeah. Can we go back to local peak? <laughs> God, you think, because we had some questions about Niskins, too. That right, should have cued right. us. That was probably one of the other uh, watch leads right yeah, into right. the website. Yeah, can you explain what those Niskins are for? <laughs> <laughs> and when to use them? A demo? I'm like, oh yeah, they're actually made of gray plastic and there's a spring inside. <laughs> This is an interesting little mini ledge here. Hmm. Adam, what does it mean? Uh, this is a this is like a iron manganese kind of crust <laughs> that is. Oh. No. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Was that a sneeze or something? Yeah, that was. A... I thought someone screamed. <laughs> Me <Yeah>. too. <laughs> <laughs> It's an attempt to not be too loud. <laughs> Just when you were starting. <laughs> oh my god, I don't even remember the question. Oh, <laughs> I was taking a sip of tea at that moment. And that was <laughs> I, I honestly don't remember up. anything before that. <laughs> okay, it okay, was a shot problem. heard around the world. Time to recover. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's this? Hey, let's, let's zoom take a look in. At this. Yeah, let's zoom. Let's zoom on something. Uh, <laughs> From Noah and oh, oh my gosh! Okay, okay. it was close. Everyone, stop yelling! <laughs> I <laughs> almost dropped my coffee. Yeah. So anyway, there's this uh, an iron manganese kind of crust on this thing that the slope is probably starting to fail a little bit, and the crust is kind of breaking up. See these gigantic slabs? Oh, okay. Cool. And all this sediment. Yeah, chat is saying y'all need sleep. <laughs> we chat need is not a wrong lot of things. Things. sleep when you have coffee. Come on, chat. We have coffee. Mm -hmm. We have jokes. We Surprise have sneezes. Fellowship amongst. We have a shot of Mike wondering what the heck he's gotten himself Mike into. <laughs> Mike used to be live. No idea. <laughs> I know I got all my, my siblings, like the translation for Robert is Ropati. Ropati. Ooh, Ropati. Ropati. <laughs> Ropati. <laughs> kind of so I, I, I'm Domo trying Aragati. to think the translation yeah. for Paula and you, Samantha. What was it? No, I'm trying to think about the translation. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a cool uh, sponge. Ropati? Yeah, Ropati. Ropati. That's a good one. Yeah. There's a Norella. It's a little robot too. Robati. Domo oh. Arigato. <laughs> Mr. Domo Arigati.